Not your parents' teenage drama. Who are you? Whoever you want me to be. Okay. We first met the young OC cast on set season one. God, how do you get those veins in your arms? That is amazing. An unknown Ben McKenzie still in shock over landing the starring role as bad boy from the wrong side of the tracks, Ryan Atwood, who is thrust into the wealthy foreign world of Orange County. This is one of my first gigs, definitely my first role as a, as a regular on a television show, so I'm very new at this. California, here we come. They came out, packed a suitcase to take a meeting. Almost exactly a year to the day later, I got the part in the OC. So I'm just very, very fortunate. What do you think of Newport? I think I could get in less trouble where I'm from. You have no idea. The show's wild parties were pretty racy for prime time with no shortage of sex and drugs. Get him off, get him off. The dark side. A 17-year-old Misha Barton told us the boundary-pushing show was simply art imitating life. Kids my age, I do think that those things really happen, whether people like to admit to it or not. But I think it's a lot more realistic than you know people or parents certainly would care to admit. Everyone definitely hooks up. We also met Adam Brody and Rachel Bilson, who made TV viewers swoon as Seth and Summer. Their on-screen love turned to a real-life romance that lasted three years. You ready for the fame? Yeah, why not, right? And the fame surely came. When we joined the cast on set during season two, they were dealing with life as bona fide stars. Nobody cared about who I was or wasn't dating or who I, you know, where I went before. Fans went wild for the cast as they were presenting keys to the real Orange County town in Newport Beach. It's awesome, it's awesome. It's just another example of the show, you know, really connecting with, uh, with fans out there. It's wonderful. Season three took a dramatic turn, shocking audiences when Misha's character was killed off in the finale. It was sad, and, and everyone sort of felt that. But after four glorious seasons, the show certainly ended on a high note. Summer Roberts, will you marry me? Yes. With Seth and Summer getting married in the series finale. This whole thing has been such a whirlwind, but so amazing. You know, it's been the best experience of my life. Well, almost 20 years since that show debuted. Rachel and Melinda's podcast is out Tuesday. The OC is now streaming on HBO Max and available to own on digital and DVD.